you know what? Uh, I've wasted enough time. Donald Trump. Um, <laughs> speaking of wasting time, Donald Trump. <laughs> Last night, Donald Trump appeared at an event uh, here uh, near New Jersey to raise money to pay off Chris Christie's campaign debt. Now, remember, Christie endorsed Trump way back in February. And by endorse, I mean stood behind him wishing for the sweet embrace of death. <laughs> Christie is also now heading up Trump's transition team. And last night, Trump showed just how much he appreciates Christie's help. When Carrier and Ford and Nabisco leaving Chicago with their big plant, they're moving to Mexico. I'm not eating Oreos anymore, you know that. But. <laughs> Neither is Chris. You're not eating Oreos anymore. Wow. Damn. It has got to hurt to be called fat by fitness model Donald Trump. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And this, remember, this was a Chris Christie fundraiser. It was in front of all of his friends and family. Can you imagine what Trump's best man speech would be like? <laughs> I'd like to congratulate the lovely bride and the chunkistador she married. <laughs> no wedding cake for you. No wedding cake for you. <laughs> well, it's hard to watch that and just stand here and do nothing. So I want to take a second to talk to Chris Christie, who I'm sure right now is at home in an Oreo sleeve shame spiral. <laughs> Chris. Look, I know you made a commitment to support Trump, but don't let him treat you like this. You're beautiful the way you are. No one, no one should fat shame you. Especially at a New Jersey fundraiser. Okay? I believe their state bird is the sausage. <laughs> yeah. The bird call? Gabagoo! Gabagoo! <laughs> I guess what I'm saying is, Chris Christie, you can do better. And God, I would give anything to mean that. But believe it or not, there's a Republican even more embarrassing than Trump, congressional candidate Mike Webb. A candidate running for Congress has made a name for himself. Mike Webb describes himself as a conservative Republican and on Facebook lists his favorite book as the Bible. Take a close look at this. He posted this Google search. Yep. What he didn't know is that the tabs for porn sites were still open when he took the screenshot. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's exciting. Yeah. Wow, taking a screenshot while looking at porn, that is embarrassing. Also, I gotta say, impressive. Because you gotta hit command shift and four using only one hand. I can't, I can't imagine. Okay, but what, so what was the porn? Let, let's take a look. Okay, one tab says Layla Rivera, tight, uh, and then just the letters B O, uh, maybe booty, maybe body, we don't know. And Yvonne, sexy amateur. I gotta say, it's refreshing to see him supporting the sexy amateurs out there. <laughs> They're just in it for the love of the game. <laughs> Unlike those sellout pros who do it for the money. Of course, there's nothing wrong with the occasional pro am every once in a while for charity. I'm sorry. What was? <laughs> what was I talking about? I don't know. Was... All right, Mike Webb. Right. Okay. Now, naturally, Webb had a simple explanation for why the porn tabs were open, and by simple, I mean a 2,000-word statement. It begins. Curious by nature, I wanted to test the suggestion that somehow, lurking out in the pornographic world, there was some evil operator waiting for the one in a gazillion chance that a candidate for federal office would go to that particular website and thereby be infected with a virus that would cause his or her FEC data file to crash the FEC. Okay, uh. 
First off, curious by nature? <laughs> Never begin your porn video explanation <laughs> with the name of another porn video. <laughs> Second. <laughs> well, hey, wrong. Wrong. Secondly, secondly, this explanation is way more embarrassing than just admitting you watch porn. <laughs> it's like you're claiming you picked up a prostitute so you could drive her to the police station. <laughs> so, Mike Webb, please do not feel embarrassed. Even if voters did see this story on the internet, they've already moved on to watch more porn. <laughs>